Hey, good morning. Happy Monday morning to everyone. I hope everybody has had a good weekend. Uh, I know if you've watched Miss Liz from 3 to 50, you know my weekend wasn't that great. We lost Missy and she's been part of our family for 16 years and it was very hard. Very hard. And so this morning I got up, I uh, got to go get some tires, put on Key's truck, on his front end of his truck. So we're going to get that done and then tomorrow I go to the new cardiologist to find out about the echocardiogram ended up coming back showing that I have a grade 3 left ventricular diastolic dysfunction. <laughs> and they explained it to me that it means that uh, my heart is not relaxing enough in between beats for my heart to com feel completely. So I go to another cardiologist to, uh, to see what we need to do about that. They put me on a, a, a pill for it, so we'll see what this other cardiologist says. So, anyway, so that's how my Monday is going so far. Uh, I hope y'all's Monday is going good, and I'll talk to you in a little while. Well, just got a call from the car uh, tire place that I was going to go to get Key's truck tires. And somehow when they ordered the tires Friday, the invoice didn't go through. <laughs> so <laughs> it's, uh, we won't be getting them until Wednesday because tomorrow we have to go to Tyler to, get, uh, to the cardiologist. So all dressed up and no place to go. Oh well. So I can relax here, sit here and watch the Waltons and just enjoy myself. Oh, there's other stuff I could be doing, but I have a vision problem. I don't see it happening. <laughs> so anyway, just thought I would check in with you so you wouldn't be getting all dressed to go with me. And, <laughs> and then I had to cancel on you. So anyway, so we get to stay home. Okay, y'all, I thought I would try something new on my Saturday snouts. I'm going to kind of do a plan as I go all week. So we'll go over today. And y'all already seen what I had put down. I did remember to take my medicine. I did not get the vacuuming done. And we did not get the trash taken off. I did get some laundry done. Uh, the tires were canceled because somehow they got mixed up with the order. So we'll be getting those Wednesday. I moved that to Wednesday. I did do the kitchen some. And I uploaded some videos today. And I received my uh, May May Made It uh, monthly a stamp set. And I received my Planner Attic box. And today, uh, Monday, with the new happy, my new happy plum paper planner is what's live on YouTube. And for breakfast, we had pancakes. And for supper, we made potato soup. And I even put little notes up here that I dressed. I got dressed today, put makeup on. It was kind of low energy today, and then I did have like a sinking spell, which I don't know. But like I said, I go to the cardiologist tomorrow, which is Tuesday. And I'll have scheduled a YouTube video for Wednesday as another to-do thing for tomorrow. So we will, I will fill in tomorrow on what, what I do, and I will check in with you tomorrow night. So, good night. Good morning. Happy Tuesday morning. Well, we're fixing to head to vote. And then to my doctor's appointment, uh, I even pulled out the Lorite Pro eyeshadow palette this morning. So, got wishing me get me some good luck going, good good mojo going. So anyway, I'll talk to y'all a bit later. Okay, voting is done. I'm waiting on Keithy still in there doing his voting, and I'm waiting on him. And then we're headed to Tyler. Here comes hubby. He done his voting. We stopped by uh, the vet hospital to pick up uh, Missy's paw prints. They uh, did a paw print for us uh, 
uh, so we'd have it uh, to remember Missy by. So we had to stop by here and get it right quick, and then we'll be headed on to Athens, not Athens, to Dallas. Here he comes. Woo! It's warm today. I'll be glad when fall, when actual fall gets here. Well, I guess it is because it's not burning up hot, but it's, I'm still, I'm ready for cool weather. Okay, guys, I have finished at the doctor's office, and he said that I was, I'm not for sure, <laughs> when I vlog to y'all, sometimes I forget that y'all don't see it until I upload it, so let me make sure I've explained what's been going on, because y'all know the first fault was the arrhythmias that I was having, and that's the reason why uh, they sent me to uh, a cardiologist that specializes electrophysiology, a cardiologist, because of uh, my heart rhythm it was off. And then he ordered the echocardiogram, and then the echocardiogram came back and showed that I had a grade 3 left ventricular diastolic dysfunction. And, that's, and they put me on another medication, which is actually a... Uh, blood pressure medication. It's an ACE inhibitor and for the rhythm they have me on a beta blocker. So anyway, that's why the woman said the cardi and this cardiologist that specializes in pumping of the heart. And he said that uh, he, I just got finished seeing him. He said that I'm on the right track. That everything just takes time and the lightheaded spells that I, you know that I've had is just going to take time to get everything situated. And plus uh I think I've mentioned it before. I had the gastric bypass back in 2012. Well, I had stopped taking my calcium and uh, just because I don't know why. But anyway, so I, I need to get back on that because that can affect your uh, your heart arrhythmia. I didn't realize that. I did not. I thought calcium was just bones. But knowing a cellular level, it can affect your heart rhythms. And so that's where I sat. So I'm on the right track. He says that he wasn't going to, he doesn't, he wouldn't mind doing a stress test on me, but he wasn't going to twist my arm to do one since I had a heart cath over about six years ago and it came back fine. And plus, I'm going to continue to see the electrophysiology cardiologist, you know, on a regular way, you know, as, as I go see him again in December. And then, so I don't have to see him again, the one I just seen again, unless the electrophysiology cardiologist thinks I need to see him again at, another, at, another, at a later time. So anyway, I'm on the right track and I'm doing what I need to be doing and I need to, of course, get back on my diet, lose some weight. That will help, of course, too. So that's going to be on, be on a go. I do, this is so close to the holidays. I don't know. So that's going to be a resolution for the first of the year. I need to get back on track and once I get this heart arrhythmia straighten out I will be back on walking regular and getting this weight down so anyway that's the story and that's all I gotta say about that as Forrest Gump says anyway it's good news so like I said it was a little stressful like, like I, yesterday when I had the lightheaded I had a lot a very weak spell yesterday and a lot of it could be you know could be stress because between losing Missy and worrying about these tests and all this other it's just been one thing after another it's been it's been hectic and so and he and I do suffer from severe anxiety and depression he said that could be part of it and the weight thing is is hard because of the depression medication I have to take uh, so it's like I'm not for sure where that cut off <laughs> because <laughs> I got a phone call but anyway so I'm on the right track I need to get back walking as soon as I get this uh, cardiac arrhythmia I'm thinking about getting me like a Fitbit or something to uh, to wear when I walk that way I can watch my heart rate and stuff uh, but probably won't be doing too much until after I see the elect electrophysiologist cardiologist again I'll see him December the 27th and that'll be just about time for the new year to be around and me to be getting fit and getting ready so anyway that's where i'm at i'm on the right track and i'm gonna be okay and let's see what else we get into okay y'all so tuesday uh tonight tuesday night we'll go over my my calendar my plan as we go here to weekly uh i scheduled my youtube video that's up today which will be at wednesday i'm sorry I ordered my calcium that I need off the internet because I never was able to pick it up in Tyler yesterday because the doctor's office was so slow. 
uh, where we had to, where I used to go and buy it. And I just did a chill evening. There were some issues with, anyway, just always or something seems. Anyway, so we just had a chill evening. Uh, was relieved with some of what the doctor said, but just exhausted. So we just chilled and I laid in bed and Keith watched the lecture, <laughs> the, uh, the uh, election stuff, but yay, Trump won. And I did, I did note that I was dressed. And I did wear makeup yesterday, and we did check our mail. We didn't. I really didn't get any uh, groceries yesterday. Today, uh, this is Wednesday morning. And I I didn't get to do this last night. Today we gotta go get tires on the truck, and then we'll pick up some groceries there. And there was no video yesterday, and we ate at Papa Cita's. Uh, there in Tyler yesterday. So that was my day yesterday and we'll get started on today now. Okay y'all, I have to excuse this wild hair today. We're getting up, we're fixing to take the trash off, go get the tires for Keith's truck and see what else we can get into. Needless to say, all this running around this week and last week, <laughs> we're just a little bit pooped. We're just a little bit tired. So, woo, Keith's truck is loud. We're at the dump. Do y'all hear that noise? That's, they're using a jackhammer to take down that little overpass. <laughs> so anyway, so we're at the dump. You see hubby dumping out the trash. So I thought I would take y'all to the dump on hump day. <laughs> hump dump. Coming in hot to the post office. Sweetie always comes in backwards to the post office. <laughs> I hope this isn't too shaky. I'm having to use my selfie stick since we're in Keith's truck. I do want to thank everybody that has prayed for me and all your thoughts and prayers. Uh, I'm not gonna lie; these last this last month has been been very hard and uh, very trying. But I know God's got this, and just thank y'all so much from the bottom of my heart for everything. This hair is looking wild for every every minute. <laughs> Every second of the day. Woo! Anyway, so we're finished at Walmart. Figured out what we needed. Now we're here getting Keith his uh, vapor stuff. And then we're going to head home and chill and relax. Can you look at these these eyes? Look at these bags. And these eyes. Woo! I'm getting old. I'm telling you, I'm getting old. There we go. If we only had what was inside that truck. Mm-hmm. We got us some fresh eggs. Yes, sir. -y. We got two dozen of fresh farm eggs. Good morning. Happy Thursday morning. But first, I wanted to go over yesterday like I had uh, started doing. I did, of course, get dressed. Just no makeup because we went to Athens to get tires for Keith's truck. And then we got some groceries. And then I, we, I came home and I collapsed. I took a nap and I did no crafting because I just didn't have the energy. These last few weeks of going to doctors and going, leaving the house every day and uh, it has really just wore me out. I did have a video up yesterday uh, uh, showing you what I had won from scrapbooking with me, the mini Missy, and the precious friend mail that Tanya from Home with Tanya sent me. For supper, I, we just had leftover potato soup that I had made Monday. So we had just, we just let, we just heated up and had it. And so that's how yesterday all went. Today, I got my regular, uh, appointment in Palestine that I have to go to and I don't plan on going anywhere else besides there and and I'm not for sure how I'll fill in the rest of this but we will, I know I do not have a video up today so other than that we'll see how this fills out okay y'all fixing to head to Palestine to my doctor's appointment and I'm not sure after that we'll see and I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. And I'll talk to you later. Okay, y'all. Finished at the doctor's. We went by Dollar Tree. So I thought I would share what little we got at Dollar Tree. 
I found a couple of these snap closure envelopes. There's two of them in here, so I figured I could do uh, store some of my stamps in there. Pretty colors. And then, let's see here. I found some of these little treat bags. They're Ziploc treat bags. Got the little coffee on there, so I thought that'd be good for friend mail. I wanted some of these labels uh, for my planner. And it's got some peppermint. Okay, and now the thing I'm most excited about is when I'm doing painting or card making or using any kind of inks on my little table, I always have to try to find some kind of scrap paper or thin paper that, I, that doesn't want to hurt my uh, mat. I got these for a dollar. There's like 30 of them in here and they're just, and it's just for kids. It's just got craft paper. So I thought that'd be good to kind of glue down to the table and not have to worry about it going anywhere or getting it dirty. And if I, it doesn't have a grid on there or anything, but that's okay. Just gonna be coloring on it anyway. And I found this uh, this one actually has some washi. And I found the arrow one. I found these little flower ones. And I found these little rainbow ones. Isn't that cute? And I thought this, I, well, yes it does. This does have a little umbrella on it. You just can't see it. It's not around there. But I thought that was darling. So that was it. That's all the Dollar Tree. Not to rub it in or anything, but Tammy, look what I got. Mm-hmm. And you know what's in there? Vanilla Dr. Do do Pepper. Okay, good morning. Happy Friday morning. So, we're back to the planner. So, yesterday, I did get everything on my list more or less done. I uh, paid bills, went to my doctor's appointment, uh, well, grocery part, went to the Dollar Tree, did remember to take my medicine. One thing that did happen just even after we got back, we found out Dad's gone back to the hospital. He has the startings of uh, the beginnings of the pneumonia, so they've put him in for a couple of days. And so last night, I also got my craft cart organized right there that I that I carry between my craft room in here with my stuff. I got some Happy Meal from Corey, from AliExpress, and from Amazon. I didn't have any video yesterday, but I did schedule for the one that y'all are seeing today. Uh, from some a couple of Etsy uh, companies that I bought some stickers, and we, we just, I just had Roman cup of soup last night. Uh, was like a fend for yourself kind of day. So, so lucky. Hopefully enough, the doctor's stuff now will have calmed down for me. Praise the Lord, we've got that kind of under control, and. Uh, now we get dad okay and i'm sure he'll be okay they said this was going to keep him a couple of days uh you know to make sure they uh get the pneumonia under control before it gets out of control and so today i am not for sure what all i've got things on my list to do of course i'm going to edit and upload my saturday snaps i've got laundry i need to do i need to decorate my planner and so we'll see what all gets done and i hope you and this is a hard day this is a week's anniversary of us losing missy it is still hard but we know that she's not hurting and that's the main thing and we are dealing with it a little bit better so next week's a new week tomorrow's a new day and i love you guys and just thank y'all for all your prayers and your thoughts during this time and I'll talk to you later. Bye.